from what I saw in my little viewfinder, my whole ass is showing. Okay, camera, don't fall over. Don't fall over like I did at the OFD Christmas party last year. Because I was way too fucking plastered. <laughs> We're gonna do a try and haul. Let me close the door though, actually. I'm doing laundry, it's a little loud. I wasn't gonna let myself get new clothes until I had reached my goal weight, which I'm about 20 pounds away from, back to pre number one baby weight. Um, but I was like, you know what? I wanna feel good right now. So I got myself some clothes. I'm gonna share them with you. Oh, I meant to go watch the motorhome. I have a pair of jeans now that I need to grab. I'll grab those. But um, I got some uh, pieces, some that are like the one I'm wearing right now that I like probably will never actually wear out in public. Um, but there's some like more like normal pieces. So I wanted to share them with you and do a little try on haul with my um, post baby number two body. I, uh, I'm starting my weight loss journey. I'm finally getting back into a routine where I can like go to the gym now and all that stuff. So I'm pretty excited about that. I don't really fit in pretty much anything I own. And if I do fit in it, it is by the grace of God. And that button, if it flies off, it is going to knock someone out because it is so pushed to its limits. We'll just start with this one. This is really cute actually. I just like this, one of my cats is scratching the door. This is kind of bugging me. Um, and this is me sucking in. This is me not sucking in. I am on my period right now and this is just totally relaxed. Like I literally look like I'm pregnant again. So for the sake of looking and making this dress try and look as good as I possibly can, I'm gonna suck it in. But it, ignore my hideous socks with this. They are very comfortable though. It is really cute. I will say though that these straps are um, hanging on for dear life. My boobs are way too big for this. So if you have very small boobs, I think this would be a very cute dress. I might be able to wear this like maybe just to like get drinks or something, but I'm not super comfortable with how my body is looking in this right now. So I'll probably wait um, or re-give this to somebody with small I am loving this outfit. This matches my nails really well. This is um, from Aerie. Aerie has been one of my favorite places to shop just long term. Like they always have super comfy, super cute. The sun is kind of, the light is making this look a little odd. Maybe, let me pull you guys back. Now my face is really dark. You can't win, whatever. Um, it's like a waffle kind of, it's like those like um, covers that, uh, free people makes um, and Ari has actually been making them and they're way cheaper and they look the same. So this has little pockets, which I'm a big fan of, but um, I've been wearing this pretty much nonstop since I bought it. I love the color. I've been trying to not just wear black all the time. So I feel really good in this. This is something I can wear around the house. I can wear out. Um, yeah, so this is, this is a current favorite. This is so cute. It's like so soft. It is this top and it says mom life. And then on the back, I actually forgot that it said this. I forgot pretty much everything that I bought. So this is almost like Christmas for me. I'm like, ooh, what's this? Like, I don't remember what I bought, but I love the mom life on the back. And then the shorts are super cute too. Um, little bow, little fringe they are short if you have a butt um, my butt is like hanging out but like i wouldn't wear these i wouldn't wear this out in public but it's definitely really really soft so and this is a real pocket so i don't know what the heck you put in there but maybe a tampon <laughs> maybe a pacifier who knows little feature i noticed after i don't know if you can tell but the buttons are glittery i love it this is very cute but very, see, wait, does it say something on the butt? Oh my God. I totally forgot it says this on the butt. Okay, I like, the nipples are like too much right now, but there's a little piece of fabric hanging down, which is kind of making this look a little interesting right here, <laughs> but it says bite me. And um, this is actually functional, just FYI. This is cute very soft but like very revealing so yeah i if my kids were any older i don't think i would wear this in front of them even 
is cute. I'm not feeling super confident in this. Like, I feel like I just have to suck in and I can't, I like, I've been liking really baggy stuff right now. So like this whole area is like, I'm uncomfortable in with my weight right now, but um, this is really cozy. And if like, I don't know, feeling tight things on my stomach when I know my stomach is showing whether I'm at home or anywhere, it doesn't matter. Like it, it's not comfortable for me. So I probably won't pick this one up until I uh, get to where I wanna be, but um, <laughs> it is very comfortable. The pants are a little short for my tall girls. I am 5'9", and these are a little short. But the color's pretty cute. But yeah, I uh, don't think, I wish I hadn't waited so long to try all this on, I'd probably return this. But um, this came as a set, and you can also you know, pair it off if you want. Like I would wear this top probably with a bra, and um, yes, a bra. This requires a bra. You know me, I hate bras, but for this one, you kind of have to. Okay, I'll just show you guys from here because this is, uh, I couldn't get the pants on. This comes with like tight, like leggings, like it's a set. Um, the back is really cool. I do have to cover my butt somehow. Maybe I'll move the camera up, but um, this is actually really cute. I like this. I got a sweater in the same style, but the pants won't go over like my feet and my calves. So they're just not that stretchy. So they're kind of cheap. So um, yeah, uh, I could use the shirt, but not the pants. I'll show you the back. The back is actually really cool. Excuse the top of my butt. But um, yeah, uh, definitely can't wear the pants. This one is like a three piece set. It's very soft, very, it's kind of like, it's the same exact material as that green one. And I feel kind of the same way about this being a little tighter than I would want it to be right now, but it's super comfortable. Um, the fabric is like soft anyways. I might have to blur my nipples out though. I can, you can kind of, you can see through it, but it comes with this little guy. Um, it's pretty cheap, but like, I don't know. Can you tell how cheap it is on camera? I mean, other than the fact that you can see my areolas through it. Cute little like errand outfit, I guess. Um, the pants are actually long enough too. It's kind of random. Some of them are long enough and some of them are not. This one is cute. I don't know too much. I'm, I'm not sure about styling on this one but I thought maybe some Doc Martens would be really cute with it or some low top Converse or high top platform Converse um, or my Adidas would be kind of cute. How see-through is that on a scale of one to 10? <laughs> I would be the person that would walk out in public with nothing else on under this. I think you'd have to wear some sort of bike shorts underneath it or something because um, from what I saw in my little viewfinder, my whole ass is showing. This was really fun in theory. I honestly think I just need a bigger size too. This is a medium and it's like, I'm like, I could do it up, but again, just a little tight. But the concept, like I saw this online, I was like, oh, that is so fun with the hot pink and like the green yellow or whatever. But yeah, I think, I think I would need a large. This is, whoa. Delicious. This is actually really cute. The sleeves are like see-through and then this is this is actually kind of scratchy So I'd probably want to wear like a tube top underneath it or something, but I think it's really cute These are the jeans. I was talking about too. I got these from um, uh, American Eagle as well. They're a size 8 and they just like fit good like I like they fit me well um, like I don't feel like a sausage encasing right now, like I do in the rest of my jeans. So I decided to just buy some bigger jeans than I normally wear and like just roll with it because I just need to be comfortable and I also need to be in focus. What are you doing? But this top is actually quite cute. I like it. This sweater is like the other one that has the fun back on it. Um, this is actually pretty cute. I feel like this could actually fall all the way off though. Like I would want to wear like a bralette with this, I think. I also saw on the website that you could flip this around, but the, how low this is hanging, I'm not really sure. Let me, let me try. Maybe if you had a bralette on, like my boob is like legit about, I mean, it's cute. Don't get me wrong, like for a picture, cute. 
out and about, a nipple's gonna pop out. So maybe if I had like a bralette on or something, that would actually be kind of cute if it was like a little lacy type of one that didn't like compete with this situation right here. The sweater's kind of itchy though, you know, it's kind of cheap material, it's not like soft or anything, but it looks cute. All right, that does it for the try on haul. I am about to do some before little pictures video of my body in a bathing suit. I'm nervous about that because I feel like I'm gonna feel bad about myself while I'm looking at it, but that's okay. I just had a baby. It is what it is. Here's me talking myself into not feeling bad about it because sometimes it's just hard not to do you know what i mean the light is changing like crazy outside right now the clouds um but yeah that does it i feel like it's cheap clothing is so hit or miss like i spent a few hundred dollars on all that uh, not including the airy stuff and i just kind of feel like i'm gonna return like 87 percent of it so sometimes i just feel like i should just save my money and just buy stuff from like a step up of a place like i like some stuff from windsor is this from Windsor? No, Fashion Nova. Um, I like some stuff from Fashion Nova, but some stuff is just like such trash quality that it's not even worth it. So we'll see. But yeah, I'm gonna return like 87% of that. Uh, what are your thoughts? Do you shop at Fashion Nova? I don't know. I'm kind of like just thinking I just need to stick to like a little bit, like a little bit of a step up so I don't have to return so much shit. Thanks for watching, guys. We will see you in the next one. My stomach's growling. I'm gonna go get some food. Editing Kristen right now um, is here to tell you that I will never purchase from Fashion Nova again. I sent them an email because I'm like 10 days over the 30 day period. And I was like, hey, have a new baby. I, you know, I'm making excuses like why it took me so long to open the packaging, which I mean, it's true. But um, is there any way you guys would make like an exception a lot of this stuff that I bought is unfortunately very poor quality and I'm not happy with it. Um, let me know. Thank you so much for your consideration. And they responded back like they never even read my email. They're like, well, we have a, because I was in my email too. I said, I realized that I'm past like the 30 days. Like I acknowledged that. And this like person responded to me like I didn't even say what I said. Like, well, we have a 30 day return. I'm like, I literally was like, did you even read my email? Um, you think like they'd look at my order history over the past X amount of years and be like, you know what? We're going to give this bitch a break and we're just going to give her store credit and we'll let her send it back to us and we'll sell it or whatever. But like, no, they were like basically said no. So I was like, you know what? That just rubbed me the wrong way. So that is the last time I order from that site every time i order i need to like look at like trustpilot.com and see because so many websites have such trash like ratings and like trash clothes it's just like i'd rather just spend more money or i'd rather spend the same amount of money on fewer pieces and have them be nicer